You were in a hole like you have been in past games. What was the difference today? How were y'all able to rally today? Um, I mean, there wasn't a difference. Um, we just stuck to the game plan. And the difference is we just really kept our heads in it. We knew it. We felt like we were better than one hand going into it. We just stuck to the right. This team stuck to the right. We didn't get up to the start this year. Uh, that had nothing to do with me. Um, the team, team effort. I could have did better. Off the line could have did better. Coach could have did better. It's everybody. It's, we're all in it together, and we're just trying to get back to what, what we preach in practice. What made you think you were going to get in the first touch in the media? Did you have some help there, too? Uh, <laughs> I mean, in the moment, I had no idea. I just was like, oh, yeah, we're in there. But uh, I think Donovan Jones came in there and gave me a second, second push. So hats off to him. You guys ran counter a whole bunch in that second half. What, what did you guys see that was so successful in those plays? Um, we just were in a rhythm. So we just were going with, if it's not broke, don't fix it. Mm -hmm. So we were just in a rhythm. We just went from there. When, when you're running a play like that, what's, what's going on inside you? Just keep your legs moving, keep churning? Or what? Um, honestly, just trust your technique in the middle. Um, then once you do that, then you use your god given abilities and then go from there. Those five guys in the trenches in the second half got after it, didn't they? They did. Um, I applaud them. I get on them every every day in practice, and then they take it on to the game and see what they're capable of. You've been around Trip on fans for three years now. I mean, how, how nice is it to see him finally start to contribute and do really well in this offense for you? Uh, that's my best friend, first person, foremost. Uh, I'm hats off to him. He's been here a long time, longer than I have, and he's put in the blood, sweat, and tears for this, and he does a great job in practice, uh, getting them guys going. He even gets me going, and without him, I wouldn't even know where I would be, so uh, hats off to him. Jordan, the toughness shown by um, Brad Cecil today going down with a shoulder injury, um, I mean, <coughs> toughness by the whole team. Do you feel like the, the first three losses that you guys had kind of primed you for that moment a little bit, and to be tough for that? Um, I guess you can say that. Um, I mean, regardless of or loss, you just have to go on to the next game. Um, but yeah, he was battling the injuries, but I told him right after the game, I was extremely proud of him and how he battled and stuff like that. So. Anything you want to see change up for next week against Navy? Um, I am not in control of the plays. Whatever coach calls, I go out there and execute. Jordan, so is this kind of a, a bed not break kind of win for you guys? Uh, nope, this is just a great team win for us. Um, anything other than that is not relevant. It's just a great team for us. We're just trying to build up for that. Thanks, Jordan.